Hello Internet, welcome to Doing It Ace channel. Today we are going to do connecting to multiple databases in E2. Okay, uh, it's very simple to do. I have done some work before. I have created a new database called Advanced E2 database. And we have another database called Advanced E2, which is the database that we have been using throughout these lessons. Now, let's go to our doing this channel common config file and if you open this you will see this configuration for the connection of the first database that we have been using now if you want to connect to a second database we have to do simply is create another array element in this array so db2 and we have the edb connection as the class and we put our values here the name of our database, the username and the password. Okay, that's simply it. Now, when you want to connect to that database and query some data, for example, we have this comment table in this new database and we want to query this table. All you have to do is use ye app db2. So the name db2 comes from right here. This key is this database too and do a create command and do a select query which will give us this result so if we go to here yeah, in the branches and if we go to this controller action we get the results that we want okay that is how we created the database that we connected to of course we can create models that uh, that insert data to, the, to this database so all you have to do is go to model generator here type the name of the table and of course here you have to select the connection ID it might be DB for you guys change that to DB2 if you name this DB2 okay and just preview and generate now if you go to that file that is in models comment and if you open it you will see a public static function to get the database get db so it returns the db2 okay the rest of it is the same you can create your crud from this comment model and that crud will insert insert data to this database table okay so that is a quick lesson on how to create uh, connect to multiple databases in a u2 application this is a very common requirement that you might find if you're having a lot of data so it's pretty simple to do and i hope this helped do subscribe for more uh, do like do share and do comment of the problems if you have any about this lesson have a good day take care and have fun